And he's holding the Dremel. The Dremel tool. Yes. Typically, you buy these in a case like this. Uh huh. That is a nice case for your Dremel. Other Dremel. Let me Dremel. look. So Hold on. Accessories over Ooh, here. Ooh, right? accessories. Well, here's something. Look at this. Here's what? A, here's a special grinding Wait, stone let's accessory. Let's zoom kit. in. Look, that's that's grinding our right. Wow. To do for dentistry. Yeah. Yeah. Wait. Let's let's find your first dental patient right here. Here he is, Robbie Leonard. In the oh, studio, you're filming this crap. In the studio with us. Now, Chris, yes, we sir. Had talked about how you, I, I, I proffered the notion that you could uh, engrave with a Dremel. Remember? Yes, right. So I want you to try this. I can't try anything. I'm filming. You're gonna you. give me the camera. I'll film. Give me a camera. All right, hold yeah. on. I have something. I have okay. this all set up for you. All right, here we go. Now, as we switch the camera to Chris. Yes. Now, what uh, am here, I, here's what your coupon blank right here. Okay, what am I? What is this? It's just a, it's a piece of aluminum uh, that I've uh, painted black. Now, what am I supposed to do? Well, gr uh, etch etch your name into that. You you do that. Etch your name in there. We'll watch it. Does it matter what speed? Any speed you like. Now, Chris will try to etch his name into the gra into the aluminum blank. Now that's a burr, a burr tool on there that you're using. I'm going to show you the stuff that I prefer to use a little later on. Look at the studiousness. Look at the, the rapid determination. Wow. I haven't seen Chris concentrate this hard in a long time. Uh, what'd you get? What'd you get? Load him up radio, baby! Oh, okay. And I need a ton of dust here. Yeah, here, now take this back. Which okay. would be great for the Woohoo! Good work, good work. There Take you. this. All right. Now I'm giving you back, right? <laughs> Thank you, Robbie. <laughs> I brought my own coupon. And there goes Rob Leonard. I have one here. Okay. I'm gonna try my own hand. I think I'm a little. I think I'm a little better at this than you are. All right. Let's see. Go ahead. Hang on. Like watching Ray studiously work on that tile that he's holding on. And let's see. Hold on. <laughs> what is it saying? Dremels are, are for modelers. I'd rather steady hand than you do, don't you? <laughs> but I want to show you something else. <laughs> Wait a minute. I like mine better. <laughs> this, is, this is my my oh, grinding tool of choice. Now, what is that? This Almighty is, grinder. This is a straight. Uh, it, it's a. Um, yeah, not 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 with the guy holding it. No. <laughs> It's a you know, die grinder. Oh. You can take a tool like this with a quarter inch shaft. You That's know, quite a shaft you got there, big boy. Now, I can't power now, this up. Now, mind you, you're going to be hearing or seeing all this on Motor Mouth Radio, unfortunately. Yeah, you got, I, someone else has got to be punished with this stuff other than me. I can't power this up because I don't have shop air, but this baby, you can do cylinder heads with this. They see. Oh, so I guess that thing right about now is worthless. In this shot, in this place, yeah. So you, can, <laughs> you can use special yeah. tools like this. You can get a burr that goes up to this size, a nice big conical Ooh, pineapple. Ooh, you could use you could use that for. Uh, Let's see, if you see, the, you could uh, put that an orifice wherever you want one. Oh, there's tools on here. That Look you can at that. Countersinking. Yeah, I'm you know, sure. Things of that nature, and these are all your burrs. Let me see that. Ooh, that those can definitely take care of the hair in your nose. This is how I did some gasket port matching on my intake mm. manifolds. I'll take care of your gas, all right. You use these, but um, certainly in, in in the right form, the Dremel is is a tool of choice. Mm -hmm. If you're a modeler. <laughs> but it's not because that was I was able to scribe right on the fly there, and that looked pretty good. I thought it looked fantastic. You gotta buy another pair of pants now. <laughs> I definitely have soot all over me though. Ground down the fly, folks. See, this is a little tiny. If you look at the one on the Dremel, it's a very, very tiny nib mm, tool. Yeah, it, it looks may, familiar. It may help if you had like something behind it. So okay. <laughs> that looks good. Oh, just hold it right there. Is that good? Perfect. All right. <laughs> That's the way I want to remember my co-host. Okay. <laughs> All righty. Well, we're going to take a break right now at Motor Mouth Radio, and I am going to stop filming because... I'll see what Dina has to say. Oh, all right. You see what Dina has to say, and I'm going to hit this button. Here. I'll tell you, Dina thinks we really need to have a video and maybe therapy as well. <laughs> and Dina, you're right. Thank you. <laughs>